Here we are, it's the uh, last day of uh, 2011, down at uh, the Barla Court um, Grasmere Gardens um, Junction, Cycle Junction, where the um, barriers um, were removed a month or so ago. Um, just been speaking with a resident who, you know, quite rightly said um, they enjoy the fact now that the um, area is more accessible now um, for people with prams and short mobility vehicles. Um, and, you know, dare I say, um, majority of people are positive about the removal of them. Um, now the question is very much where we uh, position any new barriers um, because we need to make sure that uh, obviously it's still accessible and, uh, well, it still provides a, a service. So, uh, basically, hello there. <laughs> We're looking at which way and whereabouts we can position a new barrier. So, one suggestion I've just had from one of the residents is um, here because um, that would provide the function for both areas um, and obviously the lady's property is on the left so she doesn't want the uh, possibility of people um, being able to climb onto the roof etc so um, a perfectly good idea uh, is to position it um, somewhere around here so that it provides the, the function required which is to slow down um, people who are on bikes um, but we also do need, I will say this, some more signs just to remind people and potentially some markings because this is a very well used um, area, a uh, footpath and we encourage the use of walking uh, etc so yeah we do definitely need to do some uh, other work and uh, one or two signs just indicating to people and reminding them to be aware that they're about to travel onto a, a road or a cul-de-sac wouldn't go amiss but uh, there are other issues such as the uh, litter that seems to congregate down there but at the moment aside for one or two pieces it's not too bad at all to be fair so um, maybe that's the winter um, but yes yeah, so fingers crossed um, in the next month or so we'll be able to get a, uh, a solution to this situation uh, that benefits everybody uh, the local residents, the cyclists, uh, the pedestrians and those that use uh, mobility vehicles because as I say it is a very popular walk and a very nice area. So that's it for today.